I, I always think that with, when you have kids, you have to just set down this bottom line of what can't happen. And I've done it in my house, and my parents did it in, in their house, which was everyone has to like each other and get along. And if you don't, you'll get the wrath of the parents. There's no kind of, well, how does, how does make you feel when he sees that? Just, just don't hurt your brother. You know, one time my son Oliver and Henry were wrestling in their room. Oliver's three years old, two and a half years older. And I saw Ollie had Henry pinned, and I'm standing at the doorway. They don't know I'm there. And I'm thinking, okay, if Oliver hurts Henry, I will flip out. And I see him have him pinned, and then he leans over and kisses his forehead like that, which is the same thing that I would do to Ollie when I would wrestle. So I think those things trickle down, sensibility. That's pretty beautiful. So we were asked to get along, and we did. Somehow you've managed to be this seemingly level, happy guy the whole time, but there's a lot of tragedy in your life. You lost both your parents young, but you seem to have been okay with it. Did you have to learn to be okay with it? Well, I think that you become empowered in a weird way by, by loss of, at any age, but certainly when you're young, you can either go into a direction of saying, I am going to be a victim from this. I'm going to uh, be a drunk. I'm going to do drugs, but you don't know what I went through. Or you become more resilient, a little tougher. If someone doesn't like you on stage, you got your hair so mafe and your hair <laughs> standing up, you're kind of looking at them saying, I don't even know you. If you don't like me, how about I don't like you? I mean, you go to that kind of weird, <laughs> tough ass place, you know. That's probably way better training for comedy then, to steal yourself that way. Oh, it's, yeah. If anything to prepare you for failure and rejection is good. <laughs> And you've always been okay with failure and rejection? They, they can't be. No, 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 I'm never okay. <laughs> right now, I'm feeling badly. But, uh, <laughs> so far, you're doing well. Oh, thanks. Um, no, 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 I'm not saying you're, you're ready. I'm just saying that there, I think you have to prepare yourself to saying you're the boss of your life. You, you, you know, if, if you don't like me, audience, you might be right. You, I might have to do some more work. Um, but I'm not going to be deflated by it. It's just a job. It's just, you know, you try doing it.